Alright everybody, so we have seen a lot of problems happening with the SIM card with iPhone 10 that says no service, no or invalid SIM card, they're stuck on the loop of searching, or if you're having any kind of SIM failure error, then don't worry. We have decided to make this video to solve all these problems at once. Now usually this problem has something to do with the carrier. But if you think it's not the issue and you are not in the no service area, first of all, check if airplane mode is not accidentally turned on. If it's off, you can just turn it on for a while and then turn it off again just to refresh the network. At the same time, make sure there is no pending software update on your device. If that didn't solve your problem, now let's go ahead and check some screen time settings from settings. To screen time, navigate yourself to content and privacy restrictions. Scroll down in this section and in wireless data changes, make sure this option is not selected to don't allow. Apart from that, if there is a carrier setting update available, you can check it from settings again to general. If there is an update, it's supposed to pop up in here. Now, while we're in this section, some users have said that sometimes the wrong date and time might cause this issue as well. So go to date and time, and we recommend you to just set it to automatic. If none of this helped you detecting your SIM, now it's a good time to check for if there is a problem with your physical SIM. For that, we'll first turn off our iPhone to make sure it's safe. And this will give it a restart as well when we turn it back on. So now take a SIM ejector if you don't have this lying around. You can take a paper clip for that matter. Now go ahead, open up the tray with the SIM ejector, take out the SIM, check for any scratch or physical damage on your SIM, and make sure it's clean. You can also blow through this tray hole so there isn't any dirt in there as well. When you put the SIM inside again, make sure to fit the SIM back into the tray properly and then correctly attach the tray to your iPhone 10. Turn your phone back on, wait a bit to the SIM to get registered. Hopefully now your iPhone can detect your SIM. Now just in case if you're still not working, we're still here for you. There is one more surefire way and that is reset network settings. From settings to general, scroll down till the end to transfer and reset iPhone to reset. You'll have to reset your network settings. This will just delete the Wi-Fi password, remove Bluetooth and VPN and whatnot. You'll just have to reconnect again. Just go ahead, follow the prompts to reset network settings. After the network setting reset, when your phone restarts properly again, hopefully you will no longer have any type of SIM or service issues after that. If you are the one who's still getting the same issue, you can check the same SIM to another device or insert another SIM to this iPhone just to check. And then either contact Apple support or redirect your carrier from there to see if there is a hardware issue. Thank you for watching.